Good evening, I'm Matt Harris. And I'm Kipley Brown. Here's our top story. It was revealed that the death of Notre Dame linebacker Monty Teo's girlfriend in September was actually a hoax and that she never really existed. However, since Teo is Mormon, he's used to believing in things that aren't real. <laughs> Oprah Winfrey says she was mesmerized and riveted by her interview with Lance Armstrong. To be fair, she also said the same thing about the bacon at Kraft Services. <laughs> said he regrets comparing Obamacare to fascism. No word on when Whole Foods plans to apologize for charging $20 for a kumquat. <laughs> a German company has developed a new laser weapon that can destroy targets from over a mile away. Responded a Frenchman. <laughs> In France, we will not be outdone. <laughs> we are developing a giant white flag to <laughs> surrender from a mile away. <laughs> 1.6 kilometers. <laughs> Vive la France. <laughs> Kate Middleton have announced their baby is due in July, which means July will have one of the first few days in history in which a member of the royal family actually does some kind of labor. <laughs> 18 human heads were discovered at Chicago's O'Hare Airport on their way through customs. Meanwhile, in Denver, there are 18 human bodies waiting at baggage claim that are really peeved. <laughs> and John Mayer will perform at this year's New Orleans Jazz Festival. Commented a Jazz Fest organizer. In addition to John Mayer and Maroon 5, uh, we're also gonna give out Mardi Gras beads so that uh, everyone can more easily hang themselves. <laughs> Skinny bop <-ba> bye! <laughs> and now where hard news meets Hollywood here with the entertainment news is our own Pepper Jenkins. <laughs>
have discovered a structure in the universe that would take four billion years to cross while traveling at the speed of light. It's called the 405. <laughs> A Washington woman is accused of using her breasts to smother and kill her boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> however, however, the official police report lists it as a motorboating accident. <laughs> invented a smart ice cube that warns you when you've had too much to drink. <laughs> However, if an ice cube starts telling you you're drunk. <laughs> it's time to go home. A Facebook user posted a picture showing that a Subway foot-long sub was actually just 11 inches long. Commented a Subway spokesperson, uh, all right, look, here's the deal. Uh, all of our sandwiches are 12 inches. It was probably just like super cold in that subway. Kind of a leg. Maybe it was made with cold cuts. It could have been the way that the, you were looking at the angle of the sandwich. And just to clarify, all right, um, I'm talking about sandwiches, not my penis, okay? <laughs> all right, okay? All right, hey, eat fresh. 